And this last weekend, I uh, went to my parents' old house and uh, getting ready to sell that place. That was the house that uh, my dad bought when I was born. I'm 61 years old. And this is the original fish tank that he had set up with me for me when I was small. Uh, he set that up with neon tetras. I was about eight years old then. And uh, so I went up to the attic and got it. And it's still in great shape. My dad had uh, reinforced the bottom. I don't know if you can see it there with plywood to keep it square and straight all these years. It still has the original sealant. I tested it overnight. didn't leak a drop. So now I'm uh, putting this Argonite sugar sized sand. I'm washing it as we speak. I have already retrofitted the old stainless steel light fixture with a Odessa compact fluorescent and that's working out pretty good. I have the original glass that went on top, and I'll put that in front here. I'm going to add a small power head for water movement. It's a small tank, it's only about five gallons. The sand is washing out well, just like it did on my big tank when I put in it originally. This is the original light socket that I took out and then uh, retrofitted because I want to make this a, a reef tank and uh, it's doing well Just, uh, the beginnings are, are fun so it's uh, been about uh, two hours since I set this tank up and uh, little Nemo fish seems to like the water current I notice he's riding it so I think I got the setup right I put a couple of soft corals in there some pulsating zinnia you can kind of see it and the uh, Kenya coral can't really see that yet. Uh, you can see that scarlet shrimp underneath. But uh, anyway, the uh, retro reef tank is looking pretty good. I put that Odessa sticker on there. It's not really an Odessa tank. <laughs>